Hey gang, Jack Lair here, uh, just with a uh, quick video, uh, not video game related, but wanted to cover uh, Disney Plus because uh, we ended up with it. Um, we ended up getting a free year because we're Verizon subscribers, so why not? Uh, and installed it and wanted to kind of give you an idea of, of both my wife and my sons and I have all gone through it and there are great that a lot of the Disney things are in one place. Downsides. Okay, so the problem starts with making a profile. One, it never actually asks you to make a profile until you go to the website. So when you go to the website, then it's like, hey, do you want to set up a profile? And it's just a profile button up there. Second thing is, is that the profile icons, there are some huge gaps in what I would call the needed things you need in there. So just for instance, Phineas and Ferb has uh, Perry, Phineas, Ferb, and their sister who I cannot remember the name of. Candace, Candace. So there's Perry, Phineas, Ferb, and Candace. And there's, there's no mom, there's no dad, there's no Isabel, there's no uh, anybody else. Which I feel is really weird to not include those people when it's a very inclusive show. Whatever. Okay, it's profile pictures. Ignore it. Fine. Moving that aside. The search function is straight up broken. So, for instance... Uh, my wife's favorite character is Goofy, so we were searching for Goofy shorts, the little the little interstitials, and we so we searched for Goofy, and we didn't find the one that we were looking for because there's one where he goes through the Olympics and he does the Olympic torch and so on and so forth. But it wasn't showing up in the search, but then when we searched Olympics, it came up. So the search is a little wonky. Okay, we can deal with that. We started watching the cartoon and one of the things that you will have to get used to is that we watched these poorly remastered off of film stock on CRTs 30 years ago when we watched them on the Disney Channel. Or when I did when I was little. So that's about the time frame. They are now pristinely clear and it looks a little weird and I couldn't figure out what it was and it's just that when you blow up something to a size it was never meant to be seen, things start looking weird. Uh, which is why, like, the we watched Goofy and then we watched uh, some of Chip and Dale's Rescue Rangers. And you could always tell what was going to move, but now you can see it even more so. And I'm not showing any of that footage just because, oof. Um, another thing. The watching a TV series, it has no indication of where you left off. So I'm showing, we watched, my wife and I watched The Mandalorian, and there is no indication that we've watched it, that we haven't watched it, when the next thing is going to happen. Uh, there's no coming up soon, doesn't tell me when the next episode is going to happen, that's an aside. Uh, the other thing is that there are... However, I'll give it this. The Mandalorian is fantastic. All of the shows are there. Uh, Simpsons is in the wrong format, which cuts off some jokes. That's, they're fixing that. And these are things that I, I am confident they are going to improve. The weird things is that they are missing content. So if you search for Brave Little Toaster, which I'm not entirely sure, it's just the search being wrong, you get the two follow-ups of the Brave Little Toaster, you do not get the original Brave Little Toaster. Weird. Um, that and all of the educational stuff, the stuff that I really want to see, the, the stuff where Walt Disney talked about space and he showed mock-ups and drawings and how we're going to get there and what we're going to do and what it'll take to get where. I always loved those. I would find those fascinating to watch again where we are now at the point where privatization of space is nearly happening, I would find that really cool to see. But it's nowhere to be found. The I remember two weird little 
glowing outlines telling me about geometry and about circles and how to how to do math to figure all that out triangles and squares and I remember uh, and my wife does too an entire driving course where it taught you how it was satirical about what's gonna happen and it's just not there so there's some stuff's there some stuff's not and it's it's they're working on it but I want to make this video to let them know that hey we're here we're watching we would like more and this is what we would like um, I think that's about it uh, I'm gonna go ahead and head out but thank you very much for watching uh, and as always play on <laughs>